think understanding population health is really, really important uh, for um, any healthcare um, practitioner. Public health is a, you know, a broad, broad church um, working both within local authorities, um, Public Health England, of, um, both and with the NHS. There's an awful lot of on the agenda and it's very easy for eye health to be forgotten. It's just somehow at the back of the pile all the time and that, that people think of other things first. You know, data is crucial to all of this. In the current sort of, um, setting in the public health sector with limited resources, in order to make your case you have to demonstrate why eye health is important. In my mind, and I think probably in everybody's mind now you've been preached to, the eye health needs assessment is a vital tool. Without it, how do we know what we've got, what we haven't got, what works, what doesn't work? where the gaps are and what our future needs are going to be. We've really found that an eye health needs assessment made a big difference to the work that we, we've done. We were able to identify the needs of the population and also identify where services were missing. So putting those two things together that meant that we were able to work with service users and a wide variety of stakeholders to, uh, to develop new services in a way that we weren't able to do before when we didn't understand the need. Increasingly, it's going to become an important public health issue as the population gets older, suffering more with you know, cataracts, age-related macular degeneration, so glaucoma, for example. So it's one of those sort of hidden sort of health problems um, that's likely you know, to catch up with us um, in the longer term. I think if there was an increased level of awareness of eye health, then we may be able to spot problems that could be treated easily. Uh, and prevent problems from happening in the future so people would potentially be able to re retain their independence and to uh, maintain the life that they want to lead rather than becoming dependent and becoming um, uh, unable to do the things that they want to do. The optometrists I work with are acutely aware of the importance of prevention as well and that they have a role to play. The difficulty is if you're stuck in the back of a shop just doing refraction all day and you think your scope for doing that sort of thing is limited. People might think that is kind of a, a too big a, a subject for, for individuals but actually now you can go to Public Health England and look up that data on a local level. As a high street optometrist you can find out what's happening in your own area around the four causes of sight loss. Understand your local population is, is going to be kind of key to delivering the best services for them and reaching out to them as well. So that's just uh, one way um, that you can kind of really uh, bring uh, public health down to your kind of local level and um, the, the sort of things that you can do to improve services or actually identify where there are gaps in services and where something needs to be done. Thank you.